Today I'm doing a comparison of the Cobra 148 GTL ST of its AM performance versus its performance on single sideband. In order to do this I drove into a very deep canyon about three miles away in order to get the signal strength down. Otherwise I would have had to go 25 miles away to get it to about the same in, in a more or less open area. So here is the uh, AM response at the first location. And uh, you could see the peak, but there was no no indication at all of any audio response. And so now we'll switch over to uh, upper sideband and uh, do the same location on uh, upper sideband. And you could just barely hear it in there. And so uh, now we'll uh, move to the next location. A little further down the canyon. And here, oh, I got to switch to AM. Switch to AM mode. And... Uh, Again, you could see the signal, and it was a little bit stronger, but uh, you couldn't really hear anything. And so let's go back to upper sideband, and to the, uh, this is again at the second location, and uh, Okay, so that was that was quite a bit stronger. You could hear it quite clearly, whereas in the first instance you couldn't hear anything out of the AM. And so we'll go to the last location here, going back to AM, and uh, Okay, so at the last location you could hear the AM quite well. And so we'll switch back to upper sideband. And uh, radio test. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. And so the sideband was really strong. And, and so the bottom line is, is that the uh, single sideband really does get a better range than the AM broadcast on this Cobra 148 GT LST.